Hey everyone, it's Ethan here at eTrailer. Today we're going to be taking a look at and showing you how to install these PWAG all square snow tire chains with the camp tighteners on our 2022 GMC Sierra 1500. These are pretty heavy duty ladder style chains, which means that they go across the tire in these ladder style patterns. And they're gonna be very good at helping you with starting and stopping. Not gonna give you as much coverage and traction on turns as diamond pattern chains would, but they're going to be pretty aggressive and get a nice bite into some ice and snow. They're called all square because they do have these rather large square link chains, which are going to be really good at biting into some thicker ice and snow. Additionally, as you can see on the front of these chains, there are ridges, which just give you a little bit more surface area and a little bit more traction. The chains themselves are made of a manganese nickel alloy, which is going to help not only with durability, but with rust and weather protection as well. So this should last you a handful of seasons at least. The chains also do feature three of these cam tighteners, which allow you to adjust the, tire, or the chains based on the tire size or just the pressure or the, the tread that you have on your tires. The chains do come two in a set and this pretty light sort of plasticky fabric bag. Um, it's not my favorite bag in the world. These are pretty heavy duty chains and some of these points, especially on the cams or the hooks, do tend to sort of poke through these after not very long. So we recommend grabbing some sort of plastic tote or something to keep the chains in to keep them secure and to keep weather out. But overall, they're pretty straightforward to install and you can go ahead and check out how we did that now. To begin the install process, the first thing we'd like to do is to make sure that our chains are laid out nice and flat. Make sure that there's no tangles or anything twisted around itself. And we also want to make sure that our cams are facing inside because we'll need to get access to those later. We also want to make sure that the chains themselves are facing the right way. You do that by making sure that these hooks at the end of each link or the, each chain have the flat side facing down. This is the side that's going to make contact with your tire so we don't want these hooks rubbing against the tread. And once we have everything laid out and centered as best we can, We'll go ahead and grab these back to the links and drape the chains over the tire. We'll try to space everything out as evenly as we can. That's just gonna make it easier for us in the long run and easier for us to make that first connection on the back. Because these do have cams on the front, I'm just gonna start with the first link. Uh, we'll go with the second one. We can always come back and adjust this later. Now that we've made our connection in the back, we can make the same connection in the front. Go to the second link here, and then using this built-in lever tool that we have, we can start actually tightening these cams. So depending on which link you chose on either connection, you might have to tighten them more or less, but all you do is rotate them counterclockwise rather than clockwise and you'll get some nice tension. Although the cams do help with tensioning the chains themselves, they won't self-tension and adjust as the car is actually moving and the tire chains are moving as well. So we recommend picking up one of these rubber tensioners just to keep things extra secure as you're driving along. Just put those on the same way that you take the tire off in a star pattern, doing your best to make sure that they're evenly spread out along the tire and the chains. Again, just to make sure that as you're moving, things stay tight. Once you have that, they're pretty much installed. All we need to do is install the chains on our passenger side tire as well. Roll forward or backwards a couple times just to make sure that everything stays in place and you're ready to go. Overall, I think that these PWAG all square snow tire chains with the cam tighteners are a nicely built set of chains. I do like that they do have the adjustability of the cams and the manganese nickel alloy should allow them to last for a couple seasons at least. And I think overall they're a pretty solid fit on our 2022 GMC Sierra 1500.